Hi, this is Rebecca. Thanks for tuning in to Backstage Pass. I'm here with Ashlyn Gibson from The Man Who Shot Liberty Valance. Thanks for joining us, Ashlyn. Thank you for having me. So tell me about Hallie Jackson, your character in the show. Hallie is this tough-talking, hot-headed, rough-around-the-edges saloon owner who has a bit of a soft side if you can crack it. Nice. Do you identify with this character? Oh, yes. I love her. Awesome. <laughs> How is the character like you, and in what ways is she different from you? Every time I practice lines when I'm holding my friends hostage to practice lines, as actors do. As ever. Uh, yes. Right? They are always like, this character is literally you, in so many ways. <laughs> so I definitely think her hot-headedness and temper. Yeah. Sometimes. I can see yeah. that. <laughs> yeah. And then different... Um, I wish I could be as impulsive as her and be able to blindly leap for the people that she loves and just have that kind of faith and yeah. willingness to sacrifice. Take those leaps of faith. Yeah. yeah. Takes a lot of guts. It really does. It really does. Yeah. But those are such fun characters yeah. to play too. Oh yes. Because it gets you out of your comfort it zone. Does, it so does. That's awesome. And without giving away anything, what is your favorite line of the dialogue? Does it have to be my own? It could be anybody's. All right. Let's see. Yes, if you're staying here, if you're staying at the saloon and you're wanting to eat dinner, I'd avoid the pickles. <laughs> if you know the context of that, <laughs> don't know the, the context, context of that. Once it I is see very, the show, is, yes, amazing. I'll understand more. That's awesome, though. I really love that. Yep. What is the first thing you do to research and approach your role? So usually, what I like to do is research it before I audition. Um, okay as early as possible, just so I can get as accustomed to the character. Yeah. So I try to find any bootlegs or any excerpts from scripts, even if I can find the whole script. That's great too. Those bootlegs. Oh yes. Yeah. <laughs> so yeah, that's what I try to do the most. And then once okay. I get the script, just really dissect it and get yeah. everything I can. How do you approach learning your lines? So usually I'm the kind of person that I really don't learn it until I'm actually doing it. So most of my learning is when we're actually rehearsing because it's kind of hard for me to just do it at home and just recite it. But when I'm on the yeah. scene and actually rehearsing it with the other cast, it puts you more in the easier. character, in the mindset of yeah. the character when you're actually exactly. there doing it with everybody that's else. The best that's, way for me. that's true. That's good. Uh, what did you first perform? What was your first performance? Oh, wow. <laughs> I had done many things like, you know, dance recitals, gymnastics growing okay. up, but I think my first play was probably a church play. Probably a cutesy yeah. little baby church play when I was maybe seven. Nice. Something I like that. to say the same. Yeah. 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 Those are good grounding yep. plays. Good building blocks. I, I should handle say. chaos a lot. Yeah. Yeah, you learn to handle chaos, you yeah. learn all the basic beginning yes, steps yes. of theater. Uh, besides this one, what is your favorite stage show? Oh, man. <laughs> oh, I know it's a hard one. That's a really, really it's a hard, hard question. Probably Sweeney Todd. I just love Sweeney Todd. Oh, yes. It's classic. Yeah. That is a good one. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Really. I could definitely see you as Mrs. Lovett. Oh, dream roll. <laughs> that or Spring Awakening. I love Spring Awakening. That's a good one, too. Yeah. Yeah. Good choices. What do you do when you aren't doing theater? Besides work and school, um, I do aerial silks. Oh, fun. On the side. So either gigs or awesome. just practicing. Yeah. Love being up in the air. Yes, up in the air, spinning, hanging from the ceiling. Very fun. That sounds amazing. All right. Well, thank you so much. Thank you. Um, if you want to come see the show, Please join us. Uh, go to the website bravoboro.com, the man who shot Liberty Balance. Thank you.